Laramie Tunsil is having a press conference right now for the Houston Texans as he's the highest paid tackle in professional football. And we were talking during the commercial break, mm-hmm. as you said, it's quite the comeback. Quite him. the comeback. I mean, we call Dion the comeback player of the year, but Laramie Tunsil, I someone remember. was out to get him. What was that draft night? Was that 2015 yeah, in Chicago, Illinois? And it was a wild night because somebody – did we find out who did him dirty like that? Did we find out was it was – Like a stepfather or something? It was a family something. member. It was, like, sure, it was a family right? member. Where yeah. a video comes out on draft night of 20, him – 2016. Like, and 2016. like, like a, a, a Pineapple Express movie moment, okay? <laughs> a, in addition to – by the way, don't forget that night, there were also Instagram um, posts showing off – conversations between him and members of the Ole Miss mm-hmm. football staff asking for rent money and and, well, and, Freeze, and, and right? utility money. Was it was it Hugh Freeze? I, I believe so. It was a total wild night to the point where I'll say this story here. As you know, when I'm hosting an NFL draft, I stay off of Twitter. In, yeah, the, Twitter, in, in the Twitter world, I guess since 2008, is that when I first joined Twitter? I don't know what my Twitter anniversary yeah. is. Hugh Freeze was the Ole Miss coach. Oh, my gosh. I stay there. off of Twitter because Twitter, as you know, is now faster letting you know who's about to be drafted than the commissioner. Because it's what we do in the draft. It's a show. It's a television show. And so we need, you know, if we're on the air and ESPN's at break, the commissioner's not announcing a pick. Right. If ESPN's on the air and NFL Network's on a break, the commissioner's not announcing a pick. If the commissioner and the NFL have a presentation on the stage that they want to put in front of the viewing audience, they will not make a pick. And picks sometimes rack up. Sometimes it's someone's on a clock, a pick's already in, and that pick hasn't been announced, but Twitter has announced it to the world. I stay off of Twitter. It's the only time that night, Laramie Tunsil having the gas mask on, was the only time I hopped on Twitter. Charlie Hook, the King of Spring, who runs, uh, you know, is our uh, our EP of production now at the NFL Network, sitting in the truck. He's, you know, in my ear, my earpiece, helping produce the draft. He's like, you got to see this. Go to Twitter. And I'm like, dude, we have this discussion. I am <laughs> not going on Twitter. I need to be in the dark. He goes, not about this. You have to see it. And I'm like, really? He goes, trust me. I go online, I see what I need to see, and I get back in his ear. I'm like, yeah, you're right. I needed to see that. Whole world blows up. Today, he's at a press conference talking as the highest paid tackle in the NFL. Crazy. Unreal. Is that the greatest comeback, draft comeback to present day moment? Unreal. Like him and Gino. If you had told me that night when the whole conversation's going on. I would have thought he'd be out of the league in a couple I mean, years. that poor kid, I think he went to a press conference right after. He got drafted, and he's now yeah. in front of a press conference, he, and that's when the Instagram stuff came out. It hit. Remember, he was supposed to be a top five, top eight pick. Right. He went to 13. He lasted until. To like, Miami. Yeah. And I just remember, if you had told me that night, oh, by the way, um, in less than 10 years, less than eight years, he is going to be the highest paid tackle in the NFL. I'd be like, get out of here. Mm-hmm. Get out of here. But he is. Good for, good him. for him. Good for him. And good for the Texans. Good for the Texans. They got something brewing down there. They do. Glad you didn't say cooking like Laramie Tunsil did today. <laughs> I just said that. Well, he said it. Well, so he did it. say that's correct. You're fine. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern for free. 